All right then, let's see if we can do anything useful. Um, so I saw apparently quite a few people were interested in uh, watching uh, Javier build the CRJ200 model uh, on YouTube Live. Javier streams on uh, YouTube Live. Uh, I have not set this up for me. I don't know exactly how YouTube Live works. I suppose I can probably use exactly the same software, um, uh, broadcasting software that I use for Twitch. Just have to configure it a bit differently. But um, currently, this is uh, uh, this is what I'm using. So we're we're stuck with Twitch. Anyway, so so Javier live streams um, how he uses 3D Studio Max for working with the with the CRJ visual model with the, uh, the 3D model the mesh the uh, animations uh, the textures well I guess the textures are made in Photoshop and not in 3D studio but but anyway uh, so Javier has done quite a few live streaming sessions where he shows how he develops the, the CRJ model uh, how he refines it and um, today during his live streaming um, he streamed how he was working on um, this part of the model down here. Um, this this panel here, we are in the left uh, footwell area of the uh, virtual cockpit, and that um, admittedly very low poly uh, panel that you can see here that looks kind of crude is obviously a circuit breaker panel. Um, we got a couple of more of those. Um, they start in the back here, uh, behind the captain's seat with the uh, circuit breaker panel one. And that has a little, uh, panel one has a little sub panel down here, uh, for the, uh, emergency bus. Uh, then we have circuit breaker panel number two, which is behind the, um, behind the first officer's seat here. And uh, this one has a little sub panel down here for the service buses. Um, and then, of course, there's uh, circuit breaker panel number three, which is the one uh, down here in the footwell area on the captain's side, and circuit breaker panel four um, on the other side, on the on the first officer's side in the in the footwell area. Um, and there's a fifth panel that we cannot actually see here um, because it's in the uh, aft um, in the aft cargo compartment of the CRJ. If we look on the outside, the the circuit breaker panel number five would be um, uh, would be back here where you load the uh, the bulk cargo. So that one is actually not accessible in flight um, and so Javier um, in his live stream today was was busy um, modeling all those panels to get them up to a higher polygon count better uh, textures and and animations and of course the question came up during Javier's live stream is are those panels going to be functional are you actually going to have uh, working circuit breaker panels in uh, the CRJ in the upcoming version? And uh, the answer obviously is yes, because why else would we go through the trouble of animating um, all those uh, those circuit breakers? There's, uh, I think, 385 in total, roundabout. And... Um, of course, Javier wouldn't go through uh, the trouble of animating all of those um, if they wouldn't do anything. So what I'm going to do now is um, walk you through a little bit of a, a powering up of the CRJ200 uh, 